Gorringe's weekly sale to be held on Monday the 22nd of January includes a good selection of ceramics and works of art including Chinese porcelain figures here, a good quality Dresden box and cover, other Chinese works of art and as ever a good selection of silver and jewellery and various works of art here in the cabinets including some interesting uh, snuff boxes and objects of virtue, uh, some military items there, medals, and a collection of stamps and coins. They're moving around, starting with the shelves on this side. We have a small book section, a Sev style porcelain bowl, a set of uh, three bow plates dating to the 18th century. It's a Meissen blue and white oil lamp base in the onion pattern. We've got some old Sheffield plate items here. Uh, some Chinese ceramics made for the Chinese Straits market. A Fuaha figure here dating to the Ming dynasty. Some decorative bronze chimeras. Good quality uh, cinnabar lacquer jar and cover and some of the selection of Susie Cooper we have in the sale. It's a nice quality Champlevé enamel and brass four glass clock there. Coming around, Japanese embroidered picture. As ever, a good selection of traditional 19th and 20th century paintings. Moving to the other side of the shelving, we have a large pair of Derby figures dating to about 1770. Selection of minerals, good, good lot here of Chinese ceramics, an unusual stoneware teapot, sort of in the style of the Martin brothers. Selection of smalls here, garniture of three Derby vases, dating to about 1810. Uh, some Mishimware pottery teapots, often called bargeware teapots. Selection again of Susie Cooper here, coming round the other side, a uh, group of Dalton figures, some more Susie Cooper, a collection of pewter ware including an Art Nouveau bowl there, a pair of Paul Millet vases, very stylish those, dating to around 1900-1910, some more Susie Cooper, a striking Art Deco composition figure there of the archer, possibly Diana, a pair of Chinese vases, some fashion pictures here by Madeline Helston and some more pictures here by Moya Cousins. We've got some more Susie Cooper, a group lot of Wedgwood Jasper Wares, Royal Copenhagen group here. Uh, these are always popular, a nice quality barograph for the aspiring weather person, Chinese brush pot, Nice silver mounted onyx desk stand there. Some more Susie Cooper and tobacco related items, various pictures here. And in the centre we have usual collectibles and steel trivet with fire irons. Some interesting items there, rugs and carpets. Then into the main room we have various items of furniture, including a nice marquetry and rosewood parlour cabinet. Um, moving across here we've got some selection of Georgian pieces of furniture. It's a good size Victorian dining table and on top we've got a nice Aubusson tapestry panel. And then <coughs> for the mid-century collectors we've got a 1970s teak suite of dining furniture here. It's a good large and decorative Imari vase and cover there. And um, for those who prefer continental furniture, got a Louis XVI style demi lune cabinet. A watercolour by Eliza Mary Burgess. Two watercolours by Henry Charles Fox and a selection of a co continental furniture including a William IV Jardinier there 
and a nice French inlaid cabinet. And uh, there's a decorative Chinese cabinet in the sale. And then not to forget, on Tuesday the 23rd of January, we're also selling a good collection, single owner collection of silver, including Georgian pieces right up to uh, early 20th century and even more modern pieces, the highlights of which include good selection of arts and crafts silver goblets here by Omar, Omar Ramsden and Carr. And then we've got a set of six George I soup plates by the famous silversmith Paul Storr.